everyone today i have really something special for you whether you can capitalize on what i'm going to show you is going to be amazing uh the thing is that there's a new character uh on the island uh that i made today uh which actually uh can buy bugs from you and create also uh, uh sculptures from bugs you know remember uh cj the one uh, the fisherman so this one is for bugs it's called flick <laughs> flick so basically it's kind of the same thing but for bugs but this one really gives you very high prices for certain bugs uh, all, of bu all of the bugs you can get a higher price but some of them I was quite shocked to be honest for example something that actually I sold for uh, Tim and Tommy for 2000 I got it here for uh, 3500 I mean insane prices but first of all when I interacted with it and gave him a few bugs I didn't really understand the potential of making lots of bells uh, using a service and he also stays only one day uh, until 5 in the morning so I think he's going to come once a week so if he comes make sure you are ready for this now there's more to it there's some trick I think that can work even for you so you can make lots of bells uh, uh, when it comes to the island and of course you can also buy your tarantula and give you uh, uh, 12k instead of 8k but tarantulas come on if you go to the tarantula island good keep it in your storage and sell it to him but this is so much easier you're actually asking me to make a statue of my atlas moth because i caught three and i think it's a beautiful butterfly so i gave me three and hopefully tomorrow i'm going to get a new sculpture and i'm going to share it with you but let's go on to the to business the real thing uh, uh we can take advantage of his uh, presence here uh, to make lots of bells now we are actually capturing the raja brooks uh, uh between but i'm talking about the peacock butterfly i sell two only two and look what i got 7500 for two of those and i decided oh it's going to be a gold mine and why is it going to be a gold mine for those peacock butterfly because i have plenty of them they are more than the, the the cheapest butterflies i have them all over my island i can spot one every few seconds it's just crazy now i thought about the reason why it's like this and one of the reasons that i thought maybe because it's here it increases the chances but i said ah i don't think so uh another reason uh maybe uh it's because of the type of flowers now that seems actually maybe to make sense to me or maybe this is how it is you are just common but the thing is that most of those are actually spotted in a certain you see this garden that i built i have two of them one two of them every few seconds i just get out of the screen do a little walk go back i see one or two there and they're also around the island where i uh, actually planted but these type of flowers i brought from a mystery island i don't have it natively so maybe just maybe i'm just assuming here that these flowers actually actually attract the peacock butterfly because i didn't see the peacock butterfly on other uh, plants uh, flowers but i always see it hanging around uh, in this area uh, in the middle of my island where those specific flowers are now you can make tons of bells from it and i tell you because this spawns really 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 fast those uh, butterflies that's so common on my island now if it's the flowers you can try it yourself if you have those flowers you see how much i get it's crazy uh who needs tarantulas right when you have this just make sure that of course uh, you do this you save those uh, butterflies when it comes uh, next week or whatever it comes uh, the day it comes to your island uh, and make sure you capture the ones that makes the most so this is what you see here this little gather is just a gold mine and actually stay around this area and j that's what i did i just farming for bells and it was so easy because there's so many of them and this is not the only one who gave you a lot of money also the mantis by the way worth quite a lot i think uh, i'm gonna see soon i think it's uh close to uh 4k or something like that and you see tons of them and you're just farming them all over the time and it's a good place by the way because the gift is actually most of the time is coming in the middle section so i get also to get the uh, uh, gift as well so the mantis and the other rare butterflies and of course the pico butterfly is so common on my island that this, this is the reason why i made so much and uh, the same goes to you try to see if you, how common is the pico butterfly on your island if it's common on your island great 
uh, get it in store it and wait for uh, Flick to appear. If not, if you have those flowers, uh, try to uh, b create kind of, you know, like a garden because uh, butterfly attracts to flowers and it's very easy if you have a big garden to attract many of them in a very relatively compact place. So maybe it's because of the flowers, maybe it will be on other flies, I don't know, but I didn't see them on other areas where in this area they spawn so frequently that I made a lot, a lot of bells. So this is it, just a tip and a bit about this uh, flea character and how you can actually uh, capitalize on his presence to make a lot of bells from selling uh, bugs. That's it, if you have another, try others, I didn't really actually made a list of everything. But you can actually just put it in the box and see how you get without actually giving it to him. If it's, you see, it's a high price, I sell it, selling it to him. Just want to see how much uh, you get and uh, just sell it and uh, enjoy the, the bells. Uh, this is it. I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, tell me if it works for you. I really want to know if it works for you and how you actually use a flick to your advantage in order to make lots of bells when it comes to your island. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Cheers. Bye-bye.